me. I couldn't believe it when I was in a session. I looked across the studio, and at the other microphone was somebody who worked with it. They were just amazed. Mel Blank. Mel Blank, really great story. Mel Blank, I, I was placing the series at the Hannibal Barra uh, called Speed Buggy, and I was going to get a chance to work with Mel. And uh, I sat next to him, and I was so excited because I was a young kid in the thing, and he was really good. And I Mel did that. Art that he did, he used to do for Jack Benny. I think this is great, and as, as that character, I'm sitting right next to him, I'm sitting next to Mel Blanc, and he goes, and I have my line, and he has his line, he goes, okay, here's what we do. Something went. <laughs> exactly. Something went. And I thought, oh, he's not going to do that through the whole show because he has a lot of those. <laughs> right next to him. And the next line, he goes, Okay, okay. <laughs> Something went again. So after the first session, I went home. I mean, I literally was, you know, blank saliva. Up and down my arm. The next session we had, I had Alan Oppenheimer as the guest star. And he's the evil villain. And I said, Alan, you're going to want to sit next to Mel. <laughs> because all your stuff is with him. And he said, oh, yes. Oh, my God, yes. So he sits next to Mel. And I'm sitting on the left. And I got the other guest. And the other guest has no idea what has happened that first session. And he's sitting there and he's, he's sucking up to Mel as, as, as only Alan can. And he's just having this conversation. I love you and all the stuff you've done. And we start the show and Mel does this. <laughs> and I see Alan go. <laughs> and then he turns around to me for recognition. Look, and I'm like this. <laughs> so he's alone. He's all alone and wet. And as each time that Mel goes, a lot in this script. I see Alan go. <laughs> He's getting closer and closer to me, and I pay no attention at all. And by the end of the session, he doesn't want to say anything to anybody, and I see him wiping his arm off, and he's got the script. And he's going, That's my Mel Black story. <laughs>